As you've seen, there were significant changes made to Appendix I and a new Appendix N that covers balancing the risk of scalding with preventing Legionella disease. It's also important to understand that, aside from Chapter 1 on administration and Chapter 13 on fire stop protection, every chapter of the UPC has been changed in some way. Portions of the code were deleted, new lines were added, and an entirely new appendix introduced. We're going to look at these changes chapter by chapter. Some students will take classes that cover every chapter, and others will only take courses on certain chapters and appendices. It's a good idea to take stock of where the changes are in the 2021 UPC. Another goal of ours is to encourage you to take part in the ongoing code review and revision process. The ANSI consensus process involves you as a stakeholder in the UPC. If you see something that needs to be changed or could be done better, get involved by either making a proposal for a change or making a comment on a proposal for change. The more familiar you are with the latest codes, the more likely your work will be done correctly the first time. Thank you for choosing At Your Pace Online for your continuing education. We'll start by looking at the changes to Chapter 2.